Hello and welcome to the episode 15 of Beer Review. And today we have something different, as usually in my beer reviews. We have this Omnipolo Amurga Imperial Stout. So it has 11% alcohol content, that's quite a lot. And it's advertised as Black Butter Vanilla Volcano Salt Mocha Maple White Chocolate Gran Ganache. Yeah. So it's brewed by, according to Red Beer, uh, by Brewery de Molen. It's from Netherlands. It's brewed for uh, this Omnipolo brewery, what's for Sweden. So it could be interesting. So the interesting thing about it mostly is that it could be slightly salty and the last salty beer it met with my sink so maybe i hope this one will be better anyway let's see how it goes when we open it up and yes we will use this glass for it because it looks something similar to a stout glass if you have any idea, any idea if this actually is stout glass or what the hell this glass actually is supposed to be, leave your comment below. It will be highly appreciated. So let's move the glass aside and let's open the bottle. So, bottle cup is simple black bottle cup, so no extra points for that. Let's go with our usual suspects. The ratings we have, as usual, are smell, foam, appearance, and the taste. So, let's delete whatever we had before and let's go with our first characteristic the smell. Okay, it's medium to strong even like roast dark chocolate even if it was advertised as a white chocolate anyway and coffee notes as well well what you usually expect from a stout <laughs> yes some more chocolate I guess we have dark chocolate already, so let's go with the form of it, how it feels. So it's medium thick, some roasty notes and some softness as well. It's quite soft. So let's see how it goes inside of our glass. How is the head of it? Well, head seems to be... Why am I so fucking terrible today? So head seems to be rather small. So fuck. Seems I did a little bit of a mess here. Maybe because I was looking somewhere differently. Do I have anything what I can clean it with? I think there should be something here. Yeah, this should be fine. So we want everything to be clean. Because we are not the dirty channel yet. So head is medium size dark brown color. Appearance Let's see it. it. Looks well. It looks black. Well, I can't even see if it's actually brown. From no place I can see it. Anything so black as black can be. At least in this glass. So I see the foam is already gone. 
What about smell from this glass? Yeah, I would like to add some vanilla to smell as well. Because, yes. And let's go for the last and final characteristic of this beer, the taste. Okay, feels thick, roasty, I would say little to no alcohol content, alcohol feel I mean, because it does have 11% alcohol content here, quite a lot actually, well it seems very easy drinking for some reason. Yeah, some caramel, vanilla, easy drinking. Well, I do, do not feel anything really wrong about it. You can see it here. Can I focus it out? Here it seems to be as black as black can be. So, seems like a nice. Yet simple beer. Nothing wrong about it. Some bitterness in aftertaste. But not really sweet, not really too sweet. Is there sweetness? Yeah, kind of there is some sweetness, some sweetness as well. So let's go with the rating of it. So, pam pam pam. Aroma. Let's try it out once more. I wouldn't say something what would really wow me. I will leave it a six. Appearance. It's a black. I like it. Four. Actually, come to think about it. If I rate beer by its color, am I racist? I hope no. I guess I'm reverse racist because yeah, usually racism is when some like white person don't like black person. In my case, I'm white person. I like black beer. I don't know. Whatever. <laughs> Stupid question. <laughs> beer racism. Yes. Beer have rights. There is yeast in beer, and yeast have rights. So beer have rights. Anyway. Taste, I'm thinking about between 6 and 7. Well, I will leave it 7. Mouth feel, it feels good. 4. And overall score, I will put as. Hmm. I'm thinking 14, or maybe I should write it 15. Yeah, 15. So that's a good score. So overall score we have pum, 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 is 3.6 for this beer. And I think it's quite a good score. I it, it feels uh, simple, nothing really wrong about it, nothing really wows me. But it's nice, easy drinking and what's interesting about it, I don't really feel large alcohol content with it. Even despite the large percentage in it so yeah I guess that's all about it so thank you for watching subscribe to my channel leave a like under this video write comment if you have anything to say any suggestions what the hell is this glass have you tried this beer did you like it I did so <laughs> I guess that's all thank you for watching Bye and see you soon.